Well, loud as hell, the new day. This is my Creed impression. <laughs> See my life, it go on a day. Nope. you here to tell you a little story. Now, of course, all you guys out there have homies, right? Friends, compadres, muchachos, muchachas. Um, that's all about, uh, that's all I got. But just because they're your friends, it doesn't mean that you're gonna agree on everything. Every now and then, you guys are gonna bump heads because why? You're two different people and you got two different thoughts. Now, for me, I don't mind disagreeing with people. Just because you don't agree with me, it doesn't mean that you're stupid. It doesn't mean I think any less of you. It just means that we're different. Depending on the subject, though, you can't just walk around saying you wanna touch babies and be like, oh, you're different. That's okay. <laughs> no, I'm calling cops. I'm talking about like trivial shit that doesn't have anything to do with the core person you are on the inside. Now with this friend of mine, I got into a bit of an argument. And every time you argue with your friend, you already know it's about the dumbest shit on earth. So this is what the argument was about. It was about sushi. <laughs> so I was making the argument that when it comes to sushi, that most of the time you don't need soy sauce and wasabi. So after I said that statement, this motherfucker came back with a response of, Well that's because you stupid as fuck! Oh, really dude? It's like that? You gonna just, you gonna just go 0 to 100? Like, okay, that's cool, motherfucker. One of my biggest pet peeves on earth is people who don't know how to disagree politely. Do you know what I mean by that? It means that just because somebody disagrees with you, it doesn't mean that you have to attack them. A lot of people take disagreements as an attack on themselves, so they preemptively strike on their asses. Why I can't have my own opinion without being stupid? Huh? Huh? It's fucking sushi! Yesterday you used the word conversate, motherfucker, and I didn't say anything about that, you dumb fuck! Talking about we conversated. Bitch, you went to college. It's so weird because at a certain age, you would think people would be beyond this kind of shit. Disagreements are supposed to happen. Not everybody thinks the same, not everybody is built the same. The only difference is, is that you have to be respectful of other people's thoughts. And yes, I said have to, not should, because if you are not, you just might get fucked up for it one day. For example, I disagree constantly online in front of this camera, depending on who you are because if you bump the shit, I don't want to get my ass beat. Met this dude yesterday, he just got out of prison, he asked if he could play my Xbox 460. I said, you know what? It is an Xbox 460. You don't correct the thug on his numbers and letters, education makes him mad. <laughs> to think that somebody is beneath you because you guys don't share the same train of thought is incredibly infuriating. And it's always over stupid shit. That's how wars start, mother. I should know, I'm Korean. Korean people mad all the time. Korean people are angry for no reason and shit. Have you seen a Korean person pray in church? <laughs> Sound like they mad at Jesus and shit. He's some night. Amen. Are me and this guy still friends? Of course we are. That's why we say the word friends. Even though we disagree, we can talk about it and then come to a mutual understanding. But then again, I did get the last word in. David, man, I'm sorry about that. Sometimes I just get defensive. You know what, dude? I understand. It's probably payback from what I did yesterday. What? What'd you do yesterday? I fucked your mom. Bitch! Happy birthday, David So.